Yo, I met, how you doing? You wanted to have an uh, excursion for Wario Stadium to get a three, hour, three lap. I think you should go for sub 13 on NTSC. That would be fair, something like that. With my method, you should be able to get 12 something, 12 5x, maybe better. Uh, world record is 12.13 for NTSC, converted, Paul world record is 12.08, which is pretty sick. Uh, I'm gonna explain the things I do, so how VJ does it. I changed my game here the last couple years, since I also used the repositioning, and the repositioning makes it possible to get a tighter angle from the first jump you make so not the other ones but only the first jump so first thing you do before you're gonna start so you're gonna enter the track and you want to reposition your analog stick the way to do this is to hold R you hold R you hold L and you push the stick slightly to the right upper corner slightly you just want it out of the center so not too far to the front it's a little bit up and a little bit right so into the corner right corner then you press start then you release it and you're gonna see if it if it's gonna change if, if you jump it should change to the left so far nothing happened so I do it again so to the right corner a little bit forward then hold it and press start and R and R, L. Now I do it again, nothing changed. And you keep going until you see the, uh, the card moving to the left when you jump. So this is too much, this is not good. It should be by a small margin. Not too, not, not too many big changes. Still nothing. I use this method also for Shoko Mountain. Shoko Mountain shortcut three lap and lap also. It's something I discovered like two years ago or two or three years ago. Maybe four years ago, I'm not sure. But it's something from the last year. This is too much. You you want you want it to be slightly like really small margin, but this is too much. This is not good. So I keep going. should take less than five minutes actually to set this up maybe in one minute yeah this is good look look this margin when I jump it goes like this small margin I don't push left I don't do anything I only press R to jump and it goes slightly like this if you got this this is what we call the repositioning and the effect of the repositioning is when you jump on the wall it goes like more to the left so it goes slightly more to the left Ebony says it only matters for the first turn but I realize I can get better angles with it so whatever he says he is not always right and I should know that he only got the theory but I got the practice see what I mean? I got this world record here because of this and because of my own gameplay so this is the first thing you do. We call this the repositioning from VIJ. I use this repositioning for this track, Wario Stadium, and for Shoko Mountain uh, wall clips. So uh, where the Tenko clips. So now what we're gonna do, I'm gonna explain. Here we go. You hold left, you do left, then you do a zigzag, you keep triple eye tapping and you jump, you keep jumping. So the trick is to ho you hold you hold left from the start, right before you're gonna hit the wall, you do an MT and you jump again. So you hold left, you do a small MT in between, so right left, so it's like this. Left, right left, ah shit. Left, right left, jump, triple eye tap, going on. You always triple a tap after you did the jump. Right, left, jump, triple a tap. Keep going. 
Cute. Throw. Jump, 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 jump. Triple, triple attack. You always have to triple attack in the air. That's very important to accelerate. If you don't triple attack, you're gonna lose. Uh, you might gonna lose some time. Depends on the angle, but most of the time you're faster if you triple attack. Slightly faster. Triple A, you can fall down, that's not a big, big deal. Even if you get stuck, keep triple A tapping and keep accelerating. You, you, you still can get a good time here. So don't only hold left and jump. Make sure you do right, left in between to get a good, uh, good angle. Right, left, jump. Triple tap, let's go. Jump. And the moment, what I aim for, what I aim for is if I'm in a slide like here, I wanna aim for this spot. So I want to, I want to hit the very inside corner of this white block here, like this. The reason I want to hit it like here is because if you hit it like here on the red part or maybe inside the red part, you're probably gonna miss the finish line and you go in front of it. So make sure you you you, you hit the white the white white uh, part there. Aim for the white part. Triple attempt. That was a little bit too uh, too close, but you can try. And always room when you come down. Don't hesitate. Just room. Triple attempt. Let's go. Jump. Always jump there. Keep going. So that's how we do it. Left, right. Jump. Triple attempt. Let's go. Jump, jump. Go triple attack, jump, jump. Sometimes I hit it on the red, as you can see, but that's, that's no big problem. That's better, that's better. It's like in between the white and the red on the inside. So that, that's where you want to hit the wall, not too, mu too much on the inside of the red. Out in, up, jump, jump, triple attack, jump. You will get a feeling for it, that's for sure. So when you make it over on left one, you shroom, and after the shroom, you start jumping. So after you hit the wall, you start jumping. Right, left. Jump, jump, let's go, keep going, jump, jump, oh, I, I can see, so if you hit it like here, this part here, it's also good, it's also good, here, this part, so from this part up to farther this way, it's all good, if you are too close to the inside of red, it's not good, then, then you probably won't cross the finish line. That's all I got to say, and it's just a matter of keep practicing. But the most important is uh, triple attempt. Trip, this triple attempt is very important. Jump, jump, jump. So you let it bounce, you wait a minute, and then you start jumping again to get the rhythm. You see, this is what I mean. You're not gonna make it, you see? Good. Jump, 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 jump. Triple tap. Left, jump, jump, ah. 
By the way, when you come down, when you come down after the first jump, it's like you do triple attempt, you hold left, but you don't do the full triple attempt. It's like you do triple attempt in the air, you hold left and then keep it up, then keep going. Jump, jump, jump. Step, jump. Ah, I missed. I missed. Triple step, jump. Ah. Okay, this is it. Let's go. Now it's your turn.